Yo. Going to take a deep shot right away. Receiver open down the field. Caught. And UAB is going to score. First play of the game goes 70 yards to Xavier Ubosi. Marcus Jones, the tailback now. Pass out to the left. One tackle to beat. A spectacular oh. play. Now, was he out of bounds before he was got the first down? He was. He played with, but he came back, and not only is he uh, better than ever, but he was all conference. And on third and ten, Johnson makes the long throw. There's Yubosi again, and that'll be a first down out to the 47-yard line. Of the Huskies. Johnston. Fires wide open, sliding safely to the 26-yard line. The catch is made for the first down by Colin Lisa. Fifth straight run, and NIU does a good job this time. That's going to be a very short gain. 12 out of 21 on the year. This one's from 25. And UAB is two for two in scoring. 25-yard field goal after another impressive drive by the Blazers. They are in command early in the Cherry Bundy Boca Raton Bowl. Yeah. <laughs> so, of course, he's showing up, making the play. I love it. Of course, of course. <laughs> and there's the first sack of the night. It's going to go on the Blazers column as brought down Childers. That'll be a loss of three. Pick up a lot of space, but good to see him push the pocket and get a sack tonight. He's pushing the pocket again. Now on the run, Childers going to fire, going to not get the first down. Oh, and an incomplete pass. A Hard hit absorbed by Dennis Robinson. Smith trying to get around. He does get chipped by a running back. And a diving catch ruled complete and a first down. And that is Colin Lisa with the grab. That's Colin Lisa. I mean, this, this guy's a receiver who's very, who was utilized very, probably not that much during the season. Didn't expect him to come out and have a first quarter like he's having, but now you keep calling number 13. Play your assignment and do your job. That's what he did right there. Yeah, Weston Kramer was in there at 255. Johnston wants to go deep down the field. That's too deep. And for the first time today, we're going to see the Blazers punt team. So NIU's defense gets a win. He's at the top there, and he's uncovered for the moment. Now they finally put a DB on him. Here's a tunnel screen. This is Great Tucker. Call. Tucker 30, Tucker 25, and down to about the 20-yard line before he is brought down by the UAB defense and Marshawn Diggs. That's a 17-yard pickup. Keep them out. Keep yeah. taking shots to the outside as opposed to going in the trenches. They go up the gut. And and they score. Score. <laughs> <laughs> you were saying right up the gut. <laughs> As you were saying, Jonathan. Yeah. Great. Go right, go right at this go UAB. Right up the gut. I think he will too. There's a lot of focus obviously on Sutton Smith, but the firm, Antonio Jones Davis, he leads the team in tackles with 119. Well, that was a great connection there for a first down for UAB at the 36 yard line. Johnston getting good time right down the middle. Lisa 15-10. In about the nine-yard line, wide open. They found a soft spot in Colin Lisa with another catch. Johnson, shovel pass. Nice Touchdown, round. Blazers. Spencer Brown. And that's using Sutton Smith's aggressiveness against him. Secondary, the outside backers, nothing is getting done between the tackles. Coming back, and is he put in bounds or not? What's the call? In bounds. Yes. This is yeah, a great catch. What a fantastic, grab. fantastic footwork on the sideline. Just a double move by Spencer Tears. This young man caught two touchdowns in a championship game against Buffalo. And here he is right a double move, knowing where he is on the field. Ooh. Excellent. That's he stays in the block. Plenty of time for Childers. He drills it. And that's the other tight end. And picking up additional yardage is Ty Harmston. And he'll get down to about the, they're going to mark him at the 13 yard line. Another Huskies first down. This outside gotcha. game. Exactly. Childers, long pass. Totally oh, end zone and it's nice broken play. up. Excellent defense made by Dijon Turner in that star position. Grass field here, by the way, one of the nicest in the country at FAU Stadium. And put three on the board for the Huskies. So Home setter for the defense, yeah. big and physical. Johnston fires, got his man, Yubosi, run out of bounds at the 45-yard line. 
Another first down for the Blazers. Q and Antonio Jones Davis on that one. Pressure from Smith that time. He oh. got to the quarterback, but not before. A touchdown pass is completed. Once again, it's Senior Yubosi. Yes, the cornerback fell down on the play. It was too easy. Tyler Johnson just had to put it up. We know Xavier's going to get the ball. Third down and 10. Low snap. Childers better find the football. He does. Trying to get out of his own way. And his teammates, he put the ball on the ground. And UAB has recovered it at the 31-yard line. Recovered by Trey Crawford. There's that man. Again, number 15 with the Q-tip on his right, the elephant Q-tip on his right hand. Like protective. I'm doing right now? Yeah, exactly. Oh, just, oh, I mean, it, it blows your mind when you're down two scores like this. You know you have to protect the ball. He couldn't find himself. He was trying. Thanks the pitch. Has a receiver down the middle. Thank you. And they go the other direction toward the sideline instead, and that's Hayden Pittman. Third string tight end. Blazers in this end. Now quarterback draw with Johnston going to run left and Northern's going to nail him man that's going to shorten your day as you see love <laughs> these dudes man <laughs> from the 35 yard line it's long enough and it's good yes sir and that's how the half will end with UAB making Northern Illinois pay for the game's first turnover and putting and three up second. on the board leading by 17 halfway to the first bowl victory in program history sometimes close to Christmas as we are it's a beautiful evening children's gonna come out firing that looked good there and that is going to be a fight for first down yardage gonna be a yard short let's check in before to the back pylon oh, comes inside they go the other way. That's he a bad call. He threw it to the ground. That he was threw a bad it call. to the dirt. Was it a bad call or a bad read? I it was a good a, read. It was a bad was throw. A bad, okay. yeah, poor okay. execution. They make a, this field goal. If they miss it, it's even a bigger win for UAB. It's good. Yep. It's a three-pointer for Northern Illinois after they had it for 16 plays. Well, that's, 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 that's the Huskies' ball if it's yep. a catch. Johnson going to go deep. One more time. Where do we see again? this? That man again, it's Yubosi. Unstoppable. Javante Hunt is going to have Yubosi in his nightmares for the next three years. At some point, they'll kick the coverage to number seven. You know what? They have, they've not been tested by a wide receiver like this all season long. True. I don't think that they have any defense installed that they practice yeah. to go to besides cover two, and that didn't work out. <laughs> the UAB defense had. Childers in some trouble here, and he, well, he didn't get sacked for the chance to play, and they even gave him a different number than his usual number, and it didn't work out there. Johnston drops in a gorgeous pass down the 38-yard line. The catch made by Andre Wilson. What a throw. That's an easy pitch to catch. And it's right around the first down mark, but it looks like by that spot, it is a first down. Looking underneath. Oh, yeah, that was, that, that ball got away from him. Yep, it didn't look, didn't look good coming out of no. the hand. Fourth down and five. And that spot kick is long enough. And three for three for the redshirt junior from Jacksonville. That's the longest field goal in Boca Bowl history. Wow, I know. Awesome. Seeing some records tonight, huh? Number Boca Bowl, number five, the Cherry Bundy Boca Bowl. Texas A&M, and then you watch them tonight, you're like, yeah, they're for real. And you know, they set the tone. Look at Childers taking off Childers here. Nice and, ooh, took a big hit. He though. took a big hit. He lowered, and he ran into number 22, Broderick Thomas. We got a hold in. Yeah, we got a flag down. We got a flag ball down. down. We got a lot going on. Great conversation we had with him when we finally got down, got time to speak with him. He mentioned that his philosophy had to change because. Over the middle. And it's picked. Northern Illinois comes up with a big defensive play. To the 30 yard line goes McKelty Williams. He doesn't have the, the arm strength for that. And Williams comes up with a pretty uh, timely pick. They needed something big on defense. You know, this is a resilient group, though. You know how Rod Carey is. They yeah, yeah, here you go. Fourth and goal from the two. They'll pitch it the other way. The foot okay, right to the one. corner. Oh, oh. loose. That's a touchback. Wow. 
Unbelievable UAB's defense forces another turnover. There goes that toughness, that violence that we talked about. That was a Jonathan Vilma type hit. That's what I'm talking about, Perry. That was just violent. We're not conceding anything. Now, I want In a moment, Alyssa certainly wants to offer her opinion on which one of the two we just showed you will win player. Look at this, Yubosi. Oh. Making a last minute campaign pitch. <laughs> exactly. Uh. <laughs> So that makes the road to the playoff about as smooth as those Ubosi street groups. And it is over. UAB has won for the first time a bowl game. Just back from the dead as a football program. Two straight bowl appearances. This one a dominant victory over Northern Illinois 37 to 13. 11th win and the greatest season in UAB Blazers football history for Bill Clark, his staff, and his players.